All right, everyone. We are at day day three, video two. Uh, yesterday was kind of crazy in between moving the mother-in-law and just day-to-day -day life. Uh, so made a lot of progress here. Um, I'm going tomorrow morning uh, up to Absolute Chemical and Equipment in Nashville to get my new eight gallon a minute machine. Uh, they are having my surface cleaner drop shipped to me. Uh, but basically I got the whole trailer here stripped. Um, and as you can see, I did, I did wash the deck down. Um, and the paint I used has held up pretty good. It was a two-part garage floor epoxy by Rust-Oleum. It came in a box. Um, if anyone's interested, I can find exactly the, the name of it, but it was a small, I think it was like a one gallon kit, uh, and you mix part A and part B in a bag. Um, it held up really, really well. There's a couple spots right here where I had a hose going. It obviously vibrated through. Um, over here, I did have one SH leak in the uh, middle of the year, so it kind of ate through right there, but overall, it held up very well. I'm surprised how much it brightened up. Um, I might throw just a coat of porch gray over this just to freshen it even more uh, just so it looks really really good because uh, I like things to look really good uh, but I got all my all my reels loose um, got the old old machine over there uh, it's all the way all the way out now uh, so the goal is going to be to take some inch and a half square tubing and build a platform up rail level with the reels for the new eight gallon a minute machine to sit um, I'm trying to figure out my positioning of my proportioner. I went ahead and I rebuilt everything inside it. Uh, took everything apart, redid all the fittings um, with that true blue uh, thread sealant, which is working really good. I like it because I don't have to go as tight, um, you know, to where things are gonna crack. Uh, so I'm just trying to figure out the positioning of everything. Uh, I'm finally installing my Flow Pro. Uh, so I think I'm gonna actually uh, pull that old reel mount out and make a new one that I think my uh, proportioning system will mount to set back a little bit. And then on top of that, I think I'm gonna have my water fed pole reel. Um, and then behind there will be my Flow Pro, my 12 volt pump for the soft wash and my 12 volt pump for my water fed pole, um, which oddly enough today, I ended up getting a window cleaning job. So the 65 gallon tank that I originally bought as my new buffer tank, I started to outfit um, as a mobile unit that I can throw in the bed of my truck um, with my current 12 volt pump and DI filter that will soon be replaced with its own. Uh, so now if I get a window cleaning job, I don't have to take the whole trailer, uh, especially if it's far, which this one happens to be. Um, started painting my IBC tote uh, cage. Uh, everything of mine is, is brand colored. Uh, so I got some nice uh, truck bed. Um, textured finish on the bottom. The rails are gonna be blue. Um, I picked up my blue for my frame, which I'm now switching to Rust-Oleum Safety Blue. I was using a farm uh, Rust-Oleum, I think it was Rust-Oleum, um, farm equipment. It was Ford Blue, uh, which was all right. You can kind of see the difference here. This is the new blue, that's the old. It's a little bit brighter. Mindful that is dirty. Um, but it's a little more of a process blue, uh, which is pretty much the color of all my signage. All my signage is in process blue. The truck and my sweatshirt is all the same. So at least it all matches. Uh, I know I'm going fast. I'm really tired and I'm kind of wound up. So I'll wrap it up here. Um, but tomorrow I'm going to get the equipment. So I will lay that up and figure out exactly where it's going to sit. And then um, also hopefully tomorrow getting the 103 feet of inch and a half square tubing that will make my uh, supports going across for my ladder rack, my signage going across, uh, maybe some surface cleaner mounting built in. Uh, so it should be fun. Uh, next week's gonna be a lot of welding. But uh, this is where we're at so far. So just wanna try and keep up on the progress. Uh, any questions, leave them down in the comments and uh, let's uh, get uh, get going here. It's uh, we got workbook for next week. I got a rush. See y'all later.